Defending champion Yelena Jankovic had a tough battle on her hands to make it through to the quarter-finals at the Porsche Tennis Grand Prix in Stuttgart. She faced Germany's 19-year-old rising star Sabina Lisicki, who lifted the trophy in Charleston just two weeks ago, upsetting Venus Williams along the way. So the world number four had to find something special. In the second set, it was the Serbian's turn to be outclassed, and she was given a taste of her own medicine by the young pretender, who at 4-2 down produced some wonderfully unintimidated tennis to steal the set 7-5. In the third set, order was finally restored, but only after the German Wunderkind had displayed to her home fans promising talent for the future. But eventually, experience triumphed over youth, and after two hours and 13 minutes, Jankovic breathed a sigh of relief as she moved into the quarterfinals, 7-5, 5-7, 6-3. Yes, she was playing really well. She served very, very well, and she gave me a lot of trouble. And uh, you know, the balls were coming back to me really fast and, uh, you know, I needed to be alert the whole time and because I didn't know what to expect. Uh, she sometimes went for broke, you know, all or nothing and so I, I just need to be, you know, have good reactions and, you know, just try to hang in the points and, you know, try to, to fight until the end. So I'm really pleased with the win. World well, number one Dinara Safina bucked the trend of her last three matches against Slovakian Daniela Hantukova by triumphing in straight sets for a place in the quarterfinals. Playing in her first tournament since being officially crowned world number one, the Russian looked impressive, charging through the first set without dropping serve. 13, 15. Safina's best result here in Stuttgart is a quarter-final place in 2008. But in this kind of form, 2002 finalist Hantukova couldn't stand up to the pressure. Safina reached the finish line in just one hour and nine minutes to make it into the quarter-finals 6-4, 6-2. And the 23-year-old who celebrated her birthday on Monday says that reaching the world number one spot has actually relieved the pressure. I guess yeah, because now I don't, I don't have in my mind that I have to catch somebody to to win. So they have some other pressure to, uh, to beat me because they need to catch me. So I, I have nobody else in front of me. 